there's nothing worse than losing data. And I think I'm safe to say it's happened to all of us. I mean, just this summer, I went away on holiday to America for two weeks, only to come back to find that the cards that were in my Sony Handycam had corrupted and I'd lost all my video. And there was nothing I could do to get it back. You only really value data once it's gone. What would you do if you opened up your laptop only to find that your entire music library had corrupted? That's why it's so important to back up your files. So how should you back up your music library? I like to have my music stored in not two, but three locations. First, I have my main external hard drive, which is where my entire music library is stored. And this is my master copy. Then I have my local backup, which has all those same files on a second external hard drive. And this usually stays with the master copy. So if I go to a gig and something goes wrong, well, the backup drive can save the day. But then I have a second backup with another external drive, and this is my off-site backup, and this gets stored safely at a friend's house. So if someone were to steal my laptop bag with both my master and my backup hard drive in it, I can still get access to my files. And if something worse were to happen, like my house were to burn down, I can still go to my friend's house and get all of my data back. Hard drives are really cheap these days, just don't take the risk, buy a few hard drives and get a backup system in place. You may not see the value of it now, but your music library is irreplaceable. It's taken me years to put my music collection together and probably cost me more than all of my equipment put together. So to invest in a few cheap hard drives isn't really a big ask. A great alternative to buying an external hard drive for off-site backup is to use an online service like Google Drive, which allows you to store your files online. It costs around $10 a month for one terabyte of storage space, which you can access anywhere. Now, if you have a larger music library, the price is going to be a lot higher, but you can guarantee your files are going to be safe and secure. The only other thing to remember is to back up regularly. There's no point in having a backup system in place if you don't keep your hard drives up to date. My main backup drive gets updated every few days or so, thanks to Apple Time Machine, and I try and update my off-site backup every month or so. I can't stress enough how important it is to back up, not just your music library, but all your files, especially things like family pictures and videos. So let me know in the comments, do you back up your files? And if you do, how many hard drives do you use? And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments down below. And as always, thanks for watching.